We're planning our once-in-a-lifetime trip to a Disney theme park. What are the best days to go to Disneyland? Tuesday through Thursday is best. That way, you avoid the weekend rush. What about the annual rush? Don't go in the summer, over spring break, Christmas break or holiday weekends. That wipes out all the good times to go. No, not really. In the early spring, in the fall and even November before Thanksgiving are great times to do. I suppose, since you avoid the 90 plus degrees plus humidity. The hard part is getting off school, though work isn't as bad. But arrange a few days off from school with makeup work, and you'll have an amazing trip. My kids would freak if I told them they had to do homework at Disneyland. Go on a three or four day weekend when the school has teacher and service days. Then plan one more unexcused absence day to minimize missed school. Arrive on a weekend day and hit the park during a weekday. You make it sound like we're skipping school to go to Disneyland. I'm not asking you to lie that grandma died. And some schools are flexible on this. And others aren't. You could start homeschooling, and then you'd have complete schedule flexibility. Let's say we go for Easter break or Columbus break. What should we do? Hit the busiest rides on the weekdays you are there, when the lines will be the shortest. Spend the weekend days in the least crowded parks. Aren't there any other good dates? The best time is after Thanksgiving but before Christmas in January and after school starts in the fall. The best times for my kids to be there are when they aren't supposed to be there. You could just take a Disney cruise and book it for a date that works for you. The cruise, unlike the park, isn't allowed to be packed to the gill.